video is for a slider, and uh, thanks for the tip on just using a regular wall wart to get this same uh, AC synchronous, synchronous motor to work. And that's all this is here. This is just a regular plain old 6 volt wall wart. It spits out uh, 6 volts. Smoothed out with a bridge rectifier and a capacitor, but when it's idling, when there's not being any power drawn from it, the transformer's still working. And that synchronous motor doesn't care. All it cares about is the 60 hertz signal. And there it is running right off the outside of that wall wart. Now, I've got a, a kilowatt meter here to show the... Uh, let's see if I can get it to camera to pick it up. There's the watts. Now, it just stopped, and you can see what the watts went down to, 1.5 on that. So, even though this uh, wall ward is idling, it's still drawing power. And uh, when you turn the motor on, I don't know if I can get this to go again or not, it does draw more power. But anyway, thanks, uh, Slider, for um, this tip on just using a regular transformer type of wall ward. And you can get one of these uh, AC synchronous motors to run right off the outside of it. I don't think I'm going to get this to start again, but let me see here. It's not that easy to get it to go. There it goes. You have to get it synced up to the 60 hertz signal. And like I say, uh, camera's probably not going to pick that up, but you can see it's drawing more, uh, more juice when you're uh, pulling power off of it, and this is uh, a real good example of, of AC, and how uh, when you have a wall warp plugged in, even when it's not doing anything, you're drawing power from it. This is why they recommend you unplug your wall warts when you're not using them. Anyway, thanks, Slider, for that tip on that. That does work. Uh, the uh, little uh, ring magnet is diametrically magnetized. Uh, you can get them uh, online. The uh, shaft is just a piece of coat hanger. The plastic housing is a top off one of my wife's perfume bottles. And uh, that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.